Good morning, everyone. Well, here we are back again, and it's June. I don't know what happened to May. <laughs> Somehow I just don't seem to feel I've been here. Anyway, um, thank you for being with us again this morning. Um, for those of you who've asked, yes, I had a wonderful time. And one of the things I just wanted to share with you is Britain at the moment is full of these, this kind of stuff. I've, when, when I bought this ribbon, I said to the lady, you must be uh, ready to say farewell to it or like something a bit like Christmas. She said, yep, you know, it's, it's enough now. There's bunting everywhere and those people really do know how to, uh, to celebrate a special occasion. But it, it gives recognition to the Queen, I suppose you would call the mother of the nation. Maybe the grandmother of the nation. Um, but they certainly do um, celebrate those things and, and give recognition to her in a particular way. Interesting, the Queen is known um, as Her Majesty, Your Majesty. Um, some uh, people closer to who would, who, who would refer to her as Ma'am, Mom. Um, and, and if, of course, if you're very close to court, it's Mum. Um, now, so what's that going to do with today? Well, today we celebrate the feast of Mary, the mother of the church. Not exactly the Queen of England, um, and I would never suggest that they're on the same standard. Mary clearly is, is much greater than, than uh, any human being that we know of. And uh, she, she also has, uh, uh, I suppose, a different way of being addressed or, or, or understood by different people. But we're not talking about her as, um, as the mother of Jesus only, but the mother of the church. And one, how did we come up with that title? Well, it, it is linked to the fact that from the crucifix, Jesus said to, to uh, John, this is your mother. And John representing, obviously, not just um, the disciples or those people there, but representing the whole church. She is also there when the, new, when the church was born. And as uh, the mother obviously is present at the birth of the child, um, probably, um, that uh, she was there at the birth of the church. So in that regard, being the mother of Jesus, who is God, also assumes the title or is, is, is accredited with the title of Mary, the mother of the church. Uh, it's great that we have this opportunity of um, somebody of her stature uh, who we can turn to with a kind of a fondness, with an affection, with a closeness, with an endearment um, that a child would have towards a mother. And we're very grateful that we do have this opportunity of celebrating this feast today. So have a wonderful and a blessed day, and uh, we'll see you again. God bless. Bye-bye.